Welcome to this episode of Yaw of the Day. My name is Kumi Sheldon. I'm not going to do their names because the issue I they can't talk about it, they bore my heart. Like, they make my heart inside or they do me ten and ten and ten and because I just don't understand. Now, before I go even talk about them, let me start with this quote from Professor um, Manifest. He said what? The only time parliamentarians, they agree on something in the parliament house is when they, they are raising their salaries. That one, they, they agree everything. Yeah, 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 yeah. When it comes to things where you go affect the lives of the ordinary citizens in India, yeah, say no, say yes, ah, to one. Now, there is this news item and the content and the intent of the alacrities go bust your mind. Let me read it to you. This is the, the title. Members of parliament refuse to approve S. Gratia package for the executive. So the members of parliament, they have refused to, uh, to approve the S. Gratia for the president, the executive arm of government, who, uh, who is the president, you know. The, the parliamentarians have refused to agree with S. Gratia. And this is the reason. See, you know, we say the money plenty, that why they, they have decided not to approve it too. Or they are trying to pr protect uh, the public press or anything. You know. uh, what? See, listen to the reason why they have refused to approve the S. Gratia for the executive or the president. Now, let me read. Parliament has put brakes on approval of the S. Gratia package for members of the executive arm of government. The action is to draw the president's attention to increase the package of members of parliament, MPs, as containing the profit. Prof uh, Professor Ya Ntiamwa Bay the committee report. The president is expected to approve the El Gracia of MPs and other Article 71 office holders while Parliament approved that of the executive. So basically, the reason the members of Parliament haven't approved the El Gracia for the president, we say yes. <laughs> My God, go ahead. you'll be funny. <laughs> you'll be funny. <laughs> you'll be funny. The president hasn't approved yet, so they too, they are not approving the president. What do I say? You know, the, pre the executive arm of government has a final say. When the parliament people, I mean, if you did government, um, if you pass the law, uh, if they pass the law to that level, like with the executive way, they give final, you understand. So yes, the executive arm of government, they, they hasn't approved the parliamentarians, the ma, the ma money they, they demand, you know, as S. Gratia. It's almost also say, the one way they can put for them a front for the parliament, for them to approve for the, uh, the, the executive arm of government. They're not going to do. Okay, let me continue. Now, the MPs at a closed door meeting in Parliament House on Monday night to, uh, the MPs at a second, Hey, sorry. The MPs at a closed door meeting in Parliament House on Monday night to approve that of the executives expressed disappointment in their take home pay, uh, in their in their take home back pay as well as their end of service benefits. According to them, the package did not meet the minimum threshold of six hundred thousand Ghana cedis that was paid to the ordinary MPs in the sixth Parliament. Six hundred thousand Ghana cedis. There you go. <laughs> hey, more blow, more black. Instead of who send crawford person who come home as an crawford in some politicians, then I am, yeah, I am, yeah. What was the government go for? Six hundred thousand. So, um, over teacher needs me charge the other fifty-five years, thirty-two years. Or coffee and the amount twenty thousand Ghana cedis. Twenty thousand Ghana cedis. Teacher needs me charge the will cross it to thirty years. Or coffee and the amount thirty Ghana, thirty thousand Ghana cedis. Shall you uncover for you? Most of you, you people want to kill yourselves for them. Do you take 600,000 as your, your take? Hmm. Let me continue. Join new source at the meeting said the committee's recommendation put MPs at the bottom of the ladder below the executive, uh, be, below the executive, below the judiciary, and that is not fair. So yes, the MPs are therefore demanding that the president issues a paper varying the emolument of MPs before they will approve that of the executives. So basically, the MPs are saying, sir, what am I young who and chakuna who swoon If you don't make your, your bro cut now, you know who could stand. So they say, make the president issue like a statement, put a paper out, say, like, yeah, make them, make them, make, make them increase the money small, small, make them, make it put word out, say, nah, make them increase the money. Before them, they will increase the, the, the executive arm of government, them my own. Now let me continue the story. The committee's report recommends that the MP stay home at end of service of four months. Of four months of their salaries every year, 
Hey, the, hey, the committee's report recommends the MP stay home and end of service of four months of their salaries every year than they serve in the le legislature. The MPs therefore want the House to take a second look at the portions before uh, Parliament dissolves Wednesday. Meanwhile, President Kufuadu will be in Parliament today, yes, so he addressed the nation today. So basically, your members of Parliament, the people you have elected to represent you, you know, from the constituency or constituency level, you know, yes, they are there. Yes, they, they are bargaining for their end of service, end of term money. Like, so you there, let me, let me, let me just conclude. Like, make, make, make I summarize everything. Make I summarize everything to you. The Parliament of Ghana is to approve um, S. Gracia for the president and executive. Then the president will approve S. Gracia for parliament. Now, parliament is refusing to approve the S. Gracia until that of parliament increase. Joy news sources say they want 600,000 Ghana cities. So the members of parliament, according to the joint news sources, you know, uh, they are demanding 600,000 Ghana cities before they will approve that of the, what, the executive arm of government. You see the money, see the fly fly. So who is Ghana? I am not here to disrespect the work of the members of parliament. I know, yes, they work. They approve laws and all those things. But bro, some of the monies they are taking you... Hey, see? This one serve no... See, the committees that they serve on, they give them money. They, they make money from these committees and all those things. So if they are taking this, taking that, taking this, and at the end of the, the service and all those alacrities, the money that they get, eh, it not be small. It not be small. And this is a country where we they one we they depend on loans and grants, loans and grants. But look at the monies our MPs are chopping. If the money there where then they chop are fine. We don't have money in the country. And look at six hundred thousand Ghana cities. Six hundred thousand. Do you know? Do do you know? Any a tigana hanum? Any a susom susa? Ogo kasi si a se contempt of this, contempt of that. As I said, I'm not here to disrespect. Any arm of government, what do you say about you see when you sit down and think about this thing, it be very pathetic, it be sad. The amount of money we are pushing for them, all the allowances, they get down the entertainment and wardrobe allowances. Entertainment, wardrobe allowances, car allowance, and they give you accommodation, they give you security, just everything is free. And yet they are taking these huge sums of money. And you and I. We are just there, bro. Vibes, inshallah. Vibes, inshallah. And, uh, and when I see, say, young people, like, you see, you want to go and fight for these people, and it, 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 it saddens my heart. Because that's the kind of origin, it be, Kobo Sevno will come your house. So when we score, Mojiji, the life of a public servant, most of these MPs, you see, everything for them is free. Traffic crop me a free mom. Free, mumium, paper, paper, no mumium. Everything is free. Every fucking thing is free. And all this money, yeah. Tell I'm swearing, man, because when you're bro, when you're break, because the things that are happening for this country, eh? so yeah, we are, look at what they are demanding. Just say the, 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 the executive arm of government and the parliament, uh, the, 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 the legislative arm, uh, arm of government. Just say, oh, my God, we approve, we are, we, we, this one will not approve this. It is just about the money, 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 money. It's all about the money, 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 money. We just say, I'm not talking about I'm farming now. All approve, we are You see what we do for this country inside? You see what it happened? You see what it's happened? <laughs> it's okay. Me, I'm just here to tell you, say, see. Huh? My poem. And now, your video of the day. Dubai, my lover. Dubai, my friend, you have been the one, you have been the one for me, Dubai, my lover, Dubai, my friend, you have been the one for me, and I'm back to Nigeria, <laughs> no light, no light. 
Eli vera go money lati pada si le mi. Cause my mommy, oh I need me. Ah!